Among the most promising clean development mechanism investments are projects that generate electricity using wind, water power, or biomass instead of fossil fuels. You mill the sugar cane and you have the melasse and you have the bagasse. The bagasse is the biomass that is left out of the process. Normally sugar mills have tons of bagasse that they don't do anything with. And today they can burn that and sell electricity to the cities where they are located. When you turn on a biomass, a bagasse-fired power plant, you turn off a natural gas or coal-fired plant. And by doing so, you're reducing emissions. Another way to produce carbon credits is by converting methane to carbon dioxide by burning it. Anthrogenic methane is typically produced by landfills or concentrated animal feeding operations. So one excellent way to develop carbon offsets, and is commonly being done today, is to capture that anthropogenic methane, which has a fuel value, and so you can burn it for energy, and convert the methane to CO2. By doing that, you're taking a greenhouse gas, which is 20 times more powerful than CO2, and converting it to CO2. The resultant reduction in greenhouse gas effect can be sold as carbon offsets. Landfills are very big in Brazil and elsewhere. Pretty much the same concept as the pig farming industry. You collect uh, residues from households and they generate methane. We capture the methane and we burn it. So that is enough to generate carbon credits. <laughs>